Happy weekend, hobbyist. Thanks for coming back. And I just want to show you my latest haul for my uh, Forerunner build. So, Gone Gump, Reddit user Gone Gump suggested I go to zoomonmodels.com. They're based out of Hong Kong. So, when I went to that site for details, aftermarket detailing um, kits, I ended up buying 10, 20 items. I don't know how many are in here, but I finally received it. Didn't take long. And I just want to show you what I got for my Toyota 4Runner build and just some other ones that I could not help myself with. Okay, so here it goes. NSX Type R kit. This is for the Tamiya kit. Designed for the Tamiya kit. These are aftermarket parts because I'm building the NSX right now. Let's see. It's actually a lot of parts here. Look at that. Looks like uh, there's a Type R wheels here. Uh, better headlights, emblems, uh, exhaust tips. Looks like wiper blades, steering wheel, the rear cowl. Uh, a little engine plate on top, seats. It's pretty nice. Look, it looks like there's a uh, track or adjusting frame down here for the bottom of the seat. Decals, of course. Looks pretty good. So in a later video, I'll show you um, how I use these and how good they are. Uh, maybe do a before and after of the kit I'm building with and without these uh, parts. So check out zoomonmodels.com. You probably find a lot that you like on there. Uh, that's what I did. So here are some metal stickers, metal emblems. Nissan, GTR, Skyline. So I have some kits coming up that I can use these on. Super handy. Pretty nice. S2000. Also we'll be working on this build. So, hood structure. This is for the hood, the underside of the hood. So, I didn't know they made these, but I'll give this a try and you tell me if it's worth it. I don't know. I mean, my hoods are usually closed, but this looked interesting enough. I've never seen this before for uh, me to give it a try. More hood structure for A86 Truino. Truno. So, obviously, I have this kit in my sights as a possible build. I have this in my stash already. Supra. Yep, I have this one. And, you know, I bought probably too many of these for, try for trying these out, but uh, GTR, it's a Mia kit. So we'll see if these are worth it, because you can't even see these really. Some rims here. Don't remember buying that. Some Subaru emblems. You know what? I think this is a mistake. Yeah, because this is not even in a package. And I don't think I bought a Subaru one. I don't have an upcoming Subaru kit. There you go. This I can use for the NSX. 5 Zegan exhaust tips, or exhaust muffler, actually. Here. Pretty good, huh? Looks very good, actually. Here's a Supra metal exhaust. Look at that. Super nice. Oh, here's a little SMD light kit. I'm already trying to light up one of my builds, so just curious how this would work, if this would be better than doing it from scratch, which is how I'm doing it right now. So that's why I'm curious about this, and that's why I got this one. Yep, you guessed it. I have this kit and thinking about building it soon. Window masks, and for the light too. Headlights, I guess, or... Yeah, headlights or brake lights, I think so, headlights. And then the most important piece, the piece that I went on that site for 
Toyota emblems. I'm gonna use this on my Forerunner, and I needed some of these emblems. So hopefully one of these will work. And actually, even that Toyota emblem, I'm gonna try to put that onto the back of the uh, tailgate. So this is what I went for, and this is everything I ended up buying. So be careful if you go to that site. You might end up buying all this too, too much stuff. But just want, also wanted to ask you, you can put in the comments. To me, these look a lot like the um, Hobby Design aftermarket parts brand. I mean, a lot of the similar offerings, maybe not the hoods. So let me know. I don't know if one company is copying the other or not. But um, yeah, and I'll have the links to the site. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next weekend.